Oh, it's really hard. You'll... That was good brain teacher. So you had to go back. Like, man, what was the vocab from way back in the beginning? <laughs> man, I was okay. <laughs> he okay. good no. <laughs> He good no kimi wa sudo surudoi ni. Omori o tsugeta. Nice. This right here is Kusari not surudoi. Ni. Kusari, yep. Surudoi means sharp. Do you know what kusari means? Kusari is pointed. Mm, that's surudoi. Well, we, you haven't learned pointed. Um, That's togata. So surudoi is sharp. Both of them do have metal in here, but they're different points here. Kusari is a chain like from Saint Seiya. Oh, I keep I keep forgetting how I need to remember Kusari. 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 Hi, hi, hi. Sari uh, what does change. this mean? Okay. Put a weight, Omori. He attaches a weight onto the chain. Perfect. The Lord of Twilight Attaches the weight onto the chain. Nice. Do you know what maku means? To rope. Yeah, it's to rope around. To rope wrap something. around. Hi. Maku. Like a makura. The yeah. Thing you go to the sushi restaurant and they give you a maku something. Probably. So... What's this word? This roll, this wrapping word? Maku. Hi, hi. Can you read the sentence for me? Maku. It is to betray. So, so, sakamata. Sa, sakamata tega wa karada ni. Kusari o maite iru. Hai. Maite. So it is kasamata tega tega wa karada ni the minion that the the traitorous minion roll the change roll it rolled up the change at the body yeah around the body the body hi 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 around the body so my that can mean round but it's 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 like wrapping something around something so if you have a body in the middle and you take the chain and you just kind of wrap it around the body, right? So you don't have to put the body right. on the bound and roll it out like it's dough. You don't you don't have to do that for maku, which I feel like that does insinuate that in English. It's weird we have two different words there. So this is like to wrap, like a snake strangling somebody for prey. But it also means roll. But uh You'd have to guess in English based off of context. And can you read this betray, I, this this traitorous word? Sakamate. Hi, sakamata. Perfect. So sudu <clears throat> is irregular. It means to do. Do you know what the passive form of sudu is? Sudu. Passive. Surat. Peru. Suraru. Good guess. Good guess. Sadly, it is passive. So it's actually sareru. If it wasn't weird like sadu. that, you would be correct. But yeah, sareru is a passive form of suru. Sadu. Can you read this word for me? Hi. Um, nageru. Hi, nageru. You know this word? Kind of knew it before it came up. Um, nageru is to throw. Hi, to, to throw. Nage. Nageru. Perfect. 
What is this row in Japanese? Nageru. Hi, can you read this for me? Tega wa kusari o makini sareta. Hi. Sareta passes tsuru makini. Wrap the change around makini. Sareta to do. You know it's passive the minion, form. The minion pass wraps the change around passive. He got the minion was wrapped up yes. by the in change. chains. Perfect. Yep, he was wrapped up in chains. So yeah, so this is basically the same as if I had um maku into the other form. It just this comes from nisuru, which is the set out to do. So it feels like someone else is like, aha, we must get this done. Kind of um a little bit of that feeling. Mm -hmm. Shows it wasn't unintentional. Um, can you read this word for me? Hi. Um Nage Komu. Any guesses how what komu adds to this? Komu to add to this like to, to, to throw into. Hi, perfect to throw into exactly. So tukeru to attach. Do you know what the passive form of that it would be? Tsukeru is to attach. Right, Perfect. How about the passive form of nagekomu? Nagekomu. Nagekomu. Nage. Nage. Koma. Nage komareru. Perfect. Okay, so let's go read the line from the book. Uh, context, because it's been two days. Um, so our previous line was, um, if you betray the Lord of Twilight, there is one faith that you will get. And so contextually, he's describing the fate that will lie for you um, if you betray the Lord of Twilight. Hi. Kusari de guru guru. Maki ni sarete. Omori o sukerare. Yoru no waka ni nage komareru dake. Kutsuri de guru guru. Guru guru. Guru guru is a sound effect for winding around something, doing some spinnies right here. Like a top goes guru guru. Guru guru. Guru guru. Guru guru makini. Spinning around. Hi hi. Sarete. Sarete. What was spun around? Sarete. With the change. Hi, hi, hi. The chain the chain was spun around. The change was caused to be spun around and around. Mm-hmm. Omori o sukerare. The weight was added onto it. Yoru no gawa ni. Nage ko mareru dake. Thrown into the river of the night. Perfect. So, what do you think happened here? Don't need to Someone translate. Hi, hi. got wraps, changed. Someone got himself wraps up by change hi. with weight attached to it and so, so. thrown into the dark river. So, so. 
And that is the one and only fate for those that betray the Lord of Twilight. Um, yeah, yeah. That is the only so, thing. So, so. Now we have a sound effect with the Zotto. Um, that is uh, to f- it's kind of like a sh- like a quick shiver, like when you're like, Hoo! but not like cold shiver. It's uh, giving getting the heebie-jeebies is zotto. Is does it have a to at the end? So to is the thing that happens with automatopedias. So you're never gonna see this one without zot, really. So you would find it by googling zotto. But this is actually the marker saying that this is a automatopedia. So, for example, guru right. guru is a little bit different as far as like the adverbness of things. So, theoretically, yes, it does have a to, but it's the same way that like kawaii has an e at the end right here. It doesn't necessarily need that e, it's more of a marker for its role in a sentence. But you will see it with kawaii in the dictionary, and you will see to here with zo or ji, for example. Ji to. You will see, but you will also see ji by itself. Because ji is just a sound effect of being still staring at something. Okay. So let's go read the line from the book. Wait. The only thing, the only thoughts. Most important part here is this. The de. only thought. De. With the only thought. With only the thought. With only the thought. Shudder. Yeah. With only that thought, I I shudder. I perfect shiver. I tremble. Oh, it's like oh, creepy. Kanji check. What's this word again? Sakarata. Hi. To betray. How about this word? Kimatte iru. Perfect. And this one's a hard one. What is destiny in Japanese? Unme. Perfect. Unme. Nice. Oh. Dun, 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 dun. So now we are starting the diary for our last five minutes. So slideshow. This diary will be written in slightly fancy Japanese, but I will not be teaching you the fancy Japanese. Sorry about that. Um, so can you read this word for me? Koshaku. 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 Koshaku sama. Perfect. So this is um Duke. All right. Koshaku is Duke, and they were adding like Lord to here. Lord Duke. Koshaku sama. Um, what did this start with? And it was Shaku, this Duke word. Oh. Hi, Cole Shaku. Like colon for public park. Can you read this word for me? Werumeto no Kosaku wa Ano Joda. Close. It's actually is pronounced as onna when it's by itself, but it is it is kanojo or shoujo and all those words. Um but it's pronounced as onna when it's by itself. Hey, what does this mean? Um, the the um, we say it was the Duke. Hi, the Duke. The Duchess. So in this case, it would be Duchess. The Duchess. Uh, the I don't know the the feudal lord of where we met is a Duchess. Basically, yep. She's the the, the Duke of Wurmeto is female. Um, mm-hmm. do you know how to read this? Psyche. Psyche. What does that mean, Psyche Ninate? 
なって、とな、はい、to become, to approach, to get closer. Yeah, what's getting closer when you use psyching? Is this a physical thing? Is this a time phrase? What do you think? So, time phrase. Hi, hi, psyching's a time phrase. Time is getting close. Exactly. How about this word? This one's probably really hard. I bet you don't remember it. So, right.、Um, water, water, to water. Sadly, has nothing to do with water. Sarani. <laughs> it is called Gekigen. First guy, Geki. Second guy, Gen. Geki Gen is a dramatic decrease, a sharp drop. So, from this previous chapter, it was as of late. The magic has dropped super much, a lot, and we're at a loss. Gekigen. Gekigen. Recently, so, Sarani. Oh, Saiki. Um, what was Duke? Do you remember? Sorry, it was Cole. Shaka. Hi, hi. Can you read this for me? We're reading a letter. Uira. Wira. Wira. Foru. Foretsutaru. Foretsutaru. That's a small O. Foretsutaru. Foretsutaru. Kogek. Koshaku sama. Hai. Hai. Ke. Hai. So, hai ke is like deer. So, dear the Lord Duchess,、uh, we for the Sha. Do you know how to read this word?、Mm-hmm. Yes. You na. Hi. You na sakanichi. Perfect. Steep hill. This is, oops, sorry, backwards. So, we just saw this word on a different page. It meant dramatic decrease. Do you know what that was? Dramatic d e c r e a s e was I. A g a i n Does end with g a i n That's correct. A g a i n is. A g a i n g e k i g e n g e k i g e n Hi, g e k i g e n So, g e k i g e n starts right here with g e k i g e k i Can you read this word? Geki gen.、Uh, this is Kyu gen. Hmm, let's go back to the previous page and look at the kanji again. So we have Geki right here, which looks like this. And then we have Gen. Is that Gen right here?、Mm. Or is that the other guy? This is actually Gyugeki. Hi. So Gyugeki means sudden or drastic. So it doesn't actually mean decrease like Geki Gen did. This is because decrease is actually this word right here, Gen, which also shows up in the verb Heru. If you've heard that before, that's the default decrease. decreasing verb. So this, this means large decrease. And this right here is basically sudden large. What is sudden large in Japanese? This drastic, sudden, abrupt word. Q geki. Hi, Q geki. Nice. Can you read this for me? Ma biyoku wa Q geki ni geki gen shita. Perfect. You get to the magic power suddenly dramatically decrease by a lot. We got a lot of a lot. drastically decreasing going on here. So you got the drastically, drastically decreasing suddenly drastically. <laughs> kind of excessive in here. But fun little word to make. And that is where we're going to stop for the day. Bye.
Hi. So yeah, we're going to be reading a letter to the Duchess. So 